up guys it's your girl matt cox and i've got to run some errands so i've decided to take you with me to the quilt store so that we can pick out some fabric for my upcoming quilts let's see what that looks like <laughs> Okay, so I got a very nice parking space, and today we are at M&L because we're always at M&L. And I am going to see what I can get into. I have all my fabrics down here, and yes, they're crazy because my quilt is going to be crazy, and we know this. Nothing new there. Let's see what we find in the store. Well, let's see what we have here. Look at those huge signs that say 20% off everything. So right here, I wanted to show you guys these fabrics. Now these are on the floor where the, the fabric is still discounted, but it's certainly not the same discount as the back of the store where the flat folds are. And I realize I have been ridiculously bougie for I don't know how long and I would never go back here like to the sale fabric and I don't know why because I have recently found out that the same fabric that's back here there you see it right there is actually on the floor and look at how much difference it is that's $3.49 and the ones on the floor are at least six maybe seven maybe eight maybe nine dollars I forgot to check the price but they're at least double at least so make sure you come to the back of the store and don't be like me missing out on the exact same fabrics never know what you're gonna find in these stacks and they're easily shoppable like they are folded really nicely and they're usually a lot of people in the back of the store because everybody except for me knows better now right here I was going through the grays even though I'm a color girl I really do enjoy some really nice neutral grays and I'm getting ready to pull a whole bunch of Kona solids and Kona is just I don't know if it's because it's so easy to get my hands on Kona that I like Kona or is it just that they have just an array of colors um, I think it's probably because they're just easy to get but they're good colors you know they're they're colors that everybody knows about you know go grab a Kona solid there are other solids I really like Michael Miller's I like Northcott and they have a few of those I like Modus too but they really don't have the same amount as Kona you can pretty much find Kona in any store so I went ahead and I pulled these for a quilt that I'll be working on it's not going to be the next quilt. You'll see these colors in the next two quilts, I think. Actually, that's not true because I got a whole series coming of some other stuff. But just trust me, you're going to see these colors in my tulip pink quilt. And you'll see that I used that tulip pink bolt of, um, I think it's like spades and diamonds, like the suits of cards right here to match all that. You see the bolt to the right. And I pulled all the colors in that guy right there and did a pretty good job. There was only a red that I was missing. Here is some more fabric that I pulled, but I don't show you guys this yet because I want this to be a surprise. I'm really looking forward to what I do with this. And this will be coming next. That's the quilt that I'm actually touching now. And I'm using this grunge fabric. When I say grunge, it's by Moda and it's like the best blender ever look at all these colors and the way that they mix them oh my gosh guys you have to see these grunges in, in person because you'll see like a blue with a hint of green in it or pink or something it's just i love those halloween fabric is in and i think i might be able to swing a halloween quilt for the first time i think so i was kind of checking out their halloween their jack you know that kind of stuff thanks so much for hanging out with me and keep posted quilts are coming Well, guys, I think we have done an excellent job. I have so much fabric, and I only spent $100, so I've gotten enough for three... Well, I shouldn't say that, because one project has already been partially pulled. But I got a lot of fabric. I feel like I did good. So now we just got to go to the house and see what we're going to do and how we're going to put it all together. 